Hey everybody, welcome back to our channel. Welcome back to another video, you guys, right? When I take my glasses off, my hair goes crazy. But it's growing, growing, growing. Getting it done tomorrow, praise the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah, glory to God. So grocery haul day, Whole30 week number two. This is our second full week of June, Whole30. We're doing the doggone thing over here as Nicole Burgess would say, um, we doing the doggone thing. She probably would say not doggone, but whatever. Um, anywho, uh, we have found that Whole30 is working for us, which we're thankful for. And I do want to show you some of the groceries that I got for this week. I may run down a small meal plan, not real sure exactly what I'm planning for the week. Um, I did not pick up any meat. I do have meat in my freezers, so I'm thankful for that. Um, what I am going to do... I, cut my hand in the while I was putting the groceries in the car I don't know anyway I'm gonna just show you what I got and then maybe run down a few quick meal ideas to see if that would work in my in my mind for this and here we go you guys this is everything that we got for this week no meat okay we got three Things of 100% juice. They were $1.54. Y'all, I found this brand. This is um, Sevilla Coconut Milk Leche de Coco. Um, 98 cents. Not where I normally get my coconut milk from. And that coconut milk for one can is usually $1.98 or two and some change. So I was happy to find that. I picked up three cans of that. Um, I picked up two things of Zest, two uh, bar uh, soap. So my friend Tiffany over at Savvy Saving Diva um, sent me some coupons. These were 97 cents. The coupon was for a dollar off and they were free. So I got two of those for free. Um, Jackson is in the middle of some type of allergy asthma situation. So I picked up two things of uh, nose tissues, a dollar 34, dollar 32 for him. Um, almond milk, unsweetened. The kids like just the plain one. This was a dollar 82. Sweet Baby Ray's, no sugar added. Now, we have not been doing barbecue sauce or sauces of any kind on Whole30. However, we do have one cheat day a month, and our cheat day is going to be July the 4th because that is when the holiday is. We're doing a big church thing. I mean, our church is not big. We we may not, we may have 30 adults, maybe, and that's stretching it. Um, we have several kids. But um, I picked up this for... Uh, July 4th, it was $2.78, but my friend Deb uh, sent me out coupons, so I was able to get this for free. It was get one uh, no sugar added free, so I got the barbecue sauce, and I also got the honey mustard dipping sauce. I got that one free as well. She sent me two coupons. Thank you, Deb. Um, yellow potatoes, we eat these every week. They were $4.24. This uh, watermelon, I had originally picked up a watermelon for $6.78. I kept going around Walmart, kept going around, and this one was just as big, but it was a different watermelon for three dollars and some change. So I put that one back and picked up this one. Glad I did. Um, Jackson is kind of whole 30 or he eats whatever, so I got him these pretzel nuggets. I'm sure he would love those. They were four dollars and some change. Um, uh, unsweetened applesauce, original. The kids like it with cinnamon, cinnamon but we have cinnamon that was a dollar 98. Um, these twisted pretzels, Jackson likes these in the sour cream and onion ones. Well, he's never had this flavor, but he likes the twisted honey, honey ones. That was like $2.78 as well. Applesauce uh, pouches were $4 and some change. Organic uh, blueberries were like two something. Um, strawberries were $3.18. And then, of course, I got the kids fruit. Now, I know people will say, why do you buy fruit, Shakima, if you get regular fruit? Well, Alana works, and so she throws things in her lunchbox. And that works out really good. It's an M100% juice. I got cherry mix, oranges, pineapples, and orange um, peaches. They That's what the kids like. I don't usually typically, I don't eat this stuff. I'll, I'll eat a banana or just some fresh fruit. But the kids, just for convenience things, and we are on summer. Three pounds of mandarins or $3 and some change. I got a pineapple for $188. Three bags, uh, three pounds of gala apples were two. 270 something or three something I, I forget uh grapes were a dollar 72 a pound cucumbers 218 for this bag i got regular cherries and then we got the rainier cherries 
um, they were expensive. So I just picked up what, you know, as much as I could afford. Some extra virgin olive oil spray. And then we got aluminum foil. This was $182. This was like $2.36 for 75 feet. And then a big bunch of bananas. They were, I think, 59 cents per pound. So we got some yellow ones we can eat now. And then I got some green ones uh, that hopefully will take us into next week. So let me show you what else I picked up and then tell you how much I spent in a mini uh, meal plan. So in the envelope that Deb sent, um, it had a coupon for uh, cat food. This is 20 pounds of cat food. It was three pounds or larger up to $27 and some change. This bag of cat food was $18.78 for 20 pounds. And so I picked it up and this was free. I don't have a cat, but a friend at church has a cat. So I picked it up for her and I'm gonna pass it along. Um, Ma'am eats Purina Pro Plan food and we have a coupon for that up to $68 for free. But they didn't have it at Walmart. So I'm gonna keep looking. I know they have it at Pet Smart or Pet Supply Plus or Pet something. I'm gonna see if they take coupons there because I know I can get it from there for Ma'am. So I just picked that up for my girlfriend, uh, Bree. She used to be my coupon and buddy back in the day. And uh, her and her family, they have a cat. So she said, yes, her cat could eat that. And I said, perfectly, I will get it for you. And then over here, we got two packages of the Walmart waters. Now our water is getting a little low. I know that I need to pick up waters every week. And last week I did not because I think I ran out of money. But um, I picked up two this week and I'm gonna try to remember or work on getting me a water filter. Haven't figured that part out yet, but something's gonna happen here soon. So for everything that I showed you, the total bill was 118 and my grocery budget this week was $50. So let me tell you how I worked it out. I was looking, cleaning out my purse and realized the kids had given me a Walmart gift card for Mother's Day and there was $20 on that. And I needed to take back a bra that didn't fit. So I had I got $5 back on that. So I was $25 with the $50 that I had for today. So that was $75, so 118, right? So um, the cat food was like 20 bucks off and then the two sauces there was $6 and then this was another seven, $8. So $28 came off of the 118 and then I paid 75 between cash no, I paid 80 because I had five extra dollars I had found in my purse. I paid 80 and then I only had to put $13 on my uh, debit card, which I had the money in there uh, because I got a paper Sunday payout. So I had, I had a little bit in there to cover that last $13. So that is the grocery haul and how much I paid. Now let me take you down to um, talk a little bit about a meal plan. Okay, so basically we're having country style ribs tonight. We do have ribs. We have not had ribs in a while. We're just going to do those seasoned. We're not going to put any. Well, I'm actually going to um, put them in an instant pot with some of the apple juice. because, And I'm probably going to either cut up a few apples and put them in the instant pot with the ribs. Or we'll do, maybe I'll do apples after. I'll figure something out with the apples. But we're going to cook them in the apple juice. Um, with that, we will probably end up having, I know we have greens. Alana asked for cream greens. We do have pork chops. I have butterfly pork chops. I'm going to stuff those. I'm going to do like an apple spinach stuffing and I'll do the stuffed pork chops. So that'll be one meal. Um, we have ground beef. So with ground beef, we could do mm -hmm, kind of like a spaghetti situation but I don't have noodles. We do have cauliflower or I saw low carb love. I think I can't remember. Uh, that's not her name, but she did a um, chili cheese broccoli. And I was going to look to see if I could find a whole 30 chili recipe and just use nutritional yeast and do like chili cheese broccoli. So that's what I'm going to look at for that. We also have chicken. So of course we can have chicken uh, legs cause I have chicken legs. So I think I can just do legs on the grill one day this week and that'll be good. We'll do some ranch chicken legs and whatever. Oh, we have a rotisserie chicken. My friend came over yesterday and she brought two rotisserie chickens. So we do have rotisserie chicken. We can probably, 
I could probably figure out how to make a chicken salad because I usually put grapes in my chicken salad and I can have grapes now. Just gotta figure out what the base would be for the, the moisture part of the chicken salad. I have to figure that part out. Um, and then of course we'll take the legs and the wings off and just maybe have that or we'll have chicken and rice. I'll make like a whole 30 gravy and put with the chicken and cauliflower rice. So one of some of that combo deal will be what we're having for this week. Um, we have sweet potato fries going right now in the oven for lunch because we had sweet potatoes we needed to use. We're trying to be as less waste as possible and use up all the things. So that's what we're doing right now. I haven't uh, had anything. Well, I had eggs and potatoes this morning. So I am gonna try to grab some lunch. It's after one and I went to the grocery store hungry, bad move. So anywho, you guys, there it is, Whole30. We're still living our best life. I'm going to try my hardest to get to the gym today. It's raining here. Jackson's not feeling well, so we didn't go to Taekwondo yesterday. We didn't go to Taekwondo yesterday, which means I didn't get to the gym because my gym is where Taekwondo is. So um, we didn't do that. Um, Alana has a dance class, so I'm going to try to drop her off, hit the gym real quick, come back and pick her up. I'm going to do my best or walk if I if I can. Um, but Jackson's not well, so I'm really trying to make sure we get him all squared away. Anywho... There it is, you guys. Thank you all so much for stopping by. If you're doing Whole30, let us know how it's working out for you. Of course, my friend, my sister, or well, two friends, and my sister are doing Whole30. I know I have a couple of you say you're starting in July. Good, you know, prep now. Get your mind together. Prep now. Um, but we're doing the thing. So there it is, you guys. If you like the video, be sure and give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye now.